Hello, I'm Theo from Velomobile.nl and in this video I will show you how to take out a strut from our Velomobiles, in this case a Quest, but in the other Velomobiles it's basically the same principle. These are the tools that you need. You start by removing the two nuts, the stainless steel washer and the rubber washer at the top of the strut. Now you take the computer off the mount and push the wire through the wheel well. Then you can turn the Velmobile on its side so you can work at the lower side of the strut. Now you take off the nuts at the bottom of the strut using an 8mm key and a 10mm key. There are two cutouts in the strut plate so you can take the middle nut off easily. Then you need to cut the tie wrap that is holding the brake cable on the wheel well. Now you can pull out the strut with the wheel, take off the hub cap and unscrew the wheel bolt. Now you can pull the wheel off the strut. Next is to release the brake cable. Then cut the tie wraps of the computer sensor and now the strut is completely free to do any maintenance job on it. Putting the strut back you start with the brake cable. There is a special tie wrap holding the, the outer cable to the lever. Click the inner cable in the housing. Reattach the computer sensor but do not tighten the tie wraps all the way because you need to adjust the position later. Now mount the wheel. Now put the hub cap back in place. This is very important to keep the bearings lasting long. Now you can position the sensor in the right position and then tighten the tie wraps and cut the excess length. Now you can put the strut and the wheel together back in the wheel well and pull the sensor cable back through the wheel well. Put some ceramic grease or also called mounting paste on the thread of the ball joints so the nuts will always go on and off easily at a later moment. Put them back in the strut plate. Place the washers and the nuts. Then you can start tightening them with the eight millimeter key and the 10 millimeter key. The eight millimeter key is to hold the thread of the ball joint from rotating with the nut. It is pushed in between the strut plate and the ball joint. Do not forget to place a new tie wrap around the outer brake cable. This will prevent it from hitting on the spokes when riding and that will break it of course. Check that the wheel rotates freely. Now you can put the Velmobile upright again and start mounting the computer back in its mount. Make sure the wire is pulled all the way into the Velmobile and no excess wire is still in the wheel well. Now you can return the rubber washer, the stainless steel washer and the two nuts and tighten it. Tighten the first nut so the rubber washer is squeezed lightly, then tighten the second nut also lightly. Well, that's it. Thanks for watching and check out our channel for our other videos. Goodbye.